queen with soft eye boutique i have a large amazon and just online order haul of so many things that i purchased that i want to share with y'all so i'm going to do this all in one video first i want to welcome my new visitors to my channel my name is queen i am a veiled woman and this is soft eye boutique here we talk about all things dealing with feminine hygiene, sensuality, career, um, lifestyle, just really just shooting off the cuff, but it is based in feminine hygiene and sensuality. And I really truly in my heart believe that uh, feminine hygiene is directly connected, true ancestral feminine hygiene, not this foolishness, that's online. People use iodine, HIPAA cleanse, and all that to clean their nether regions and their lady parts. Um, it is just ridiculous, okay? Ridiculous. So I've already, let's start with the haul. So I brought a lot of stuff. Um, and one day, it's probably going to be soon. I'm going to do a video about why I always buy a lot of pads. And that's going to be a very vulnerable and emotional video. But start with Lamo Organic Herbal Pads. Sometimes this stuff is backwards. I'm sorry, y'all, if it is showing up backwards on this camera. But it is what it is. So Lamo Organic um, Herbal Pads infused with rose, spearmint, marjoram, frankincense, and champaca, which is magnolia. I'm from Louisiana, so we got magnolias everywhere. If you, usually around the summertime, so like the late spring, early summer, take a bath with fresh picked magnolias. It is amazing. So have these panty liners and have these uh, heavy long pads, which are 13.8 inches. And so the reason why I have these long pads is because how did I say, like I, I experienced a lot of leaks, but it's because the way that my body is made. So my pads have to be really, really, really long, y'all. Really, really long in order to catch everything. So I have these, I've already done a video on those. So you can just click through my videos and see. So the second thing I have is cotton flannel. I got buku cotton flannel. So the reason why I got this organic cotton flannel is because I have started to do castor oil packs for my womb. Really just for my total body. So for my breast, my abdomen, and my womb area. I've done castor oil packs before in the past, but I never was consistent um consistency has been a was a problem of mine in the past but it is no longer a problem of mine so i've actually started a new regimen where i've been cast the oil packing daily and let me go and get the castor oil i'll be right back to show y'all because you got to use a special castor oil not that clear stuff okay i'm back so i have um the cast the flannel that I'm going to be using. Because with the flannel, you can um, reuse this. And I've actually just, I have so many pads. So I've actually was just using some old pads, some old cotton pads that I had. But of course, I have to discard them after the use. But I want to show you all, and I'm going to do a separate video about castor oil packing. Once I get the results that I'm seeking, because I know I'm going to get it. Because I did it, I'm doing it, and I will continue to do it until that which I have done done is perfectly externalized within my world okay that's that quantum science for y'all neville goddard but this is castor oil okay this is what you do not use this is what you can get in the stove this is crap even though it's organic or whatever ain't really no healing properties in that but i don't like to waste nothing so i still use it but i got that luil mascriti so it's the palma christi oil um Haitian black castor oil. A lot of people use Jamaican black castor oil, but I'm from Louisiana. You know, the Louisiana Creole heritage and Louisiana um, and Haitian connection that we have. So I have actually used Louis Mascriti in the past with really good results. Really, really good results. I, funny story. 
I never forget, I was eating some deep fried turkey wings. The person was selling the deep fried turkey wings in a seedy alleyway, but I was, you know, just eating it, okay? And so, um, for reasons I don't even understand why I did that to this day, but yeah, I purchased some fried, deep fried turkey wings out of a CD alleyway that was fried in the CD alleyway. And immediately after I ate it, the, you know, the lymph nodes that we have underneath our neck had swelled up. I'm talking about it was engorged and I wasn't going to go to the hospital or anything like that. So at that time, I had some um, Louis Mascriti, Haitian black castor oil, and I did castor oil packs on my neck for like two or three days and it went away and I never went back to that place. <laughs> so just because something worked don't mean that you have to continue doing what you did in order for you to have to use that Haitian black castor oil if you understand what I'm saying so okay so let's this Femi Clear got some Femi Clear bacterial vaginosis serum Killed 99% of Garnerella vaginalis, which is the bacteria that causes BV. Um, I've used this. It's a two-day treatment. It does. This one doesn't burn, but their yeast infection cream does burn. Ointment does burn really, really bad. So I have used this in the past with um, very, very good results. So I always try to keep one of these on deck in case i eat something or um you know something that i encounter throws my ph off and so i have a bamboo hair brush so i do have hair underneath here so comb this come with use this brush to comb my hair so I'm excited about using this. So I do have natural hair, but I do get silk presses. And I've kind of told myself that I'm probably gonna get silk presses more. I know I'm not going back to no chemical relaxer. Just with being an attorney, I disclosed that last um, video that I did with use your dishwasher. Knowing what I know as an attorney and the mass toxic torts, which is personal injury, uh, lawsuits dealing around the chemical hair relaxers and fibroids, uterine cancer, and all of that. If I go back and use chemical hair relaxers, then I essentially deserve whatever I get. Okay, if I go back there. Because I know better. Really, everybody knows. But, you know, attorneys are held to a higher standard. So they say. But this is a detangling brush that I got. So I'm going to use this. Um, also, I have these combs that help you part. And this little thing that came with it. This was very affordable on Amazon. This was like 5 or $6 dollars. For all of these together. So I do braid my hair. I braid my own hair. Scalp braids and everything like that. I usually don't add hair. I haven't had it. I haven't added weave to my braids since I graduated from law school. And that was 2019. Like January 2019. So I haven't had weave in my hair since then. But I know how to put weave in my braids and all that. But I do like to keep my hair braided when i don't um when i don't have a six press so i have this so i'm excited about that y'all i went all out things are going so well with my law firm i'm just really in a good space right now um i've been through so much in my life yeah i'm gonna get real personal in this video but i've just been through so much y'all that i just i don't even want to say i deserve it because this is my natural birthright Everything that I'm experiencing right now. And even when I encounter some difficult times, you know, going forward in my life, because we're always going to go through those difficult times. I'm always going to maintain this feeling that I'm having right now. I feel 
so freaking good and I feel so I love sharing this information with y'all because I did not have no knowledge of none of this feminine hygiene sanitary napkins menstrual pads none of this type of stuff when I got my cycle like I'm gonna do another video on my cycle but I got my cycle when I was 11 and I didn't have nobody to talk to nobody nobody so I nobody I was really on my own really on my own and so I just kind of fumbled and finagled my way through all these years so I have um these Libit super long organic cotton cover pads they're OCS 100 certified organic cotton from Texas, USA, back sheet containing 32% sugarcane biomass film, cotton wings, extra cushion absorbent layer with cotton. And why I got these pads, let me read this, the full ingredients. So the full ingredients are certified organic cotton top sheet, cotton absorbent core, elemental chlorine free wood pulp absorbent paper, breathable waterproof biomass polyethylene, 32% contains... Uh, sugarcane so this is made in korea so i'm actually about to open it and show y'all because i have to have a long back even if so that's why i got these pads so this is a nice packaging so it says as organic as you and I'm going to open this. And I've used these before in my last cycle. But I want to show y'all. That fell. I'll get it later. How long these pads are. So this is. So if you need that extra coverage in the back. Y'all, this is long. But it is amazing. And I mean, the way that I dress, nobody is going to see that. Even if I wear uh, the Rayel pads, which I've brought them to, because I've actually worn these in court before, okay? And nobody knew. But if the way I dress, can't nobody see my behind. Anyway, but if I have these, this pad on, y'all, this is long. <laughs> but it's the coverage that... I need so I highly highly recommend the livid pads I really really do and I'm gonna have this stuff all over but I'll clean it up and I got the real pads too and last but not least I have used these products in the past and I love, love, love them. I don't know what was going on with me, why I waited so long to get these products. Again, your girl was tripping, but I was first, let me say it with a mask it, okay? These are, uh, this is for the tampons where you can wrap your tampons in and throw them away. And uh, these are for the pads. I was first introduced to these, I think I saw them at the... Baton Rouge, oops, Baton Rouge Airport. So this is touch-free disposal. Okay, I can see that. Touch-free disposal. Touch-free removal and dis disposal. So it's disposable bags for tampons. Let's see if I can open it. I really don't use tampons. Like, it has to be like my last couple of days. I just don't like it, but I want to show y'all what it looks like. But I'm going to try to do a little tutorial. Get this lighting back on. Try to do a little tutorial for y'all right quick. Oh, trying to open the sanitary pads, y'all. Give me a second. I'm coming. Okay, so this, the tampons is 26 in there. 26 baggies. 
And I got a box of three. Mask it. And it's 18 pouches in each of them. So where is that pad that I had? So the so you insert hand, you remove the item, and you invert pouch, you peel the line, and you still in discard. So it says place basket on your hand before removing the pad. And I've used this before, so say use it like a puppet. wasn't supposed to happen but <laughs> y'all get the point i'm gonna do that again for y'all <laughs> but it worked let me do it another another page y'all and i told that by mistake i'm real heavy-handed let me use this llama pad i'm real heavy heavy-handed like i've broken door handles, mops, broomsticks, and everything simply with my hands, y'all. So that wasn't mask it. That was Queen that did that. So this is what it looked like. Putting my hand in there like a puppet. Okay, I shouldn't do that. So, and ideally, of course, I'll be taking the strip off and I'm sealing it. So that way, when you go to the public restrooms, it's sealed. And I'm establish this other bag because I don't like wasting stuff, wasting no product. Okay, so look at that. It works. It works. I know it works because y'all, I've I've used these before. Okay, I really have. So they really do work. But I'm excited. About that. Put these back in there. So thank y'all for joining me in my haul. And I'm gonna do a video about my obsession with sanitary napkins. That is going to be um a very vulnerable, vulnerable video. But it needs to be said because I'm not the only one after that being by yourself and not having anybody to talk to when you got your first period and I'm still you know working through that traumatic and lonely experience so that was just me being serious right there but wanted to hop on here and um show y'all my uh store haul queen with soft eye boutique don't forget to click subscribe and don't forget to comment below if you have any questions, any any comments, anything that you want to just add on to uh, this page. Thank you all so much for viewing. This means the world to me to be able to share this knowledge with y'all. And I hope that y'all can learn from this. I hope there's some young lady out here watching this. I hope there's some older lady who are watching this, any lady learning something from this because people are not teaching this, okay? They're not teaching it. So, thank you.